。温暖的阳光，充满热带风情的沙滩依旧迷人。因为疫情沉寂了两年半，印尼忙着迎接来自全球的观光客，尤其是解封后陆续出游的中国大陆旅客。Before the pandemic, China contributed as the second largest number of foreign visitors from the pre-pandemic number of around 2.5 million. We are starting with a modest target of 255,000 Chinese tourist arrival this year. As we ramp up number of flights, as we continue to roll out packages that we will offer to our Chinese tourists, we are very optimistic. 尽管陆客预计今年只有以往的十分之一，但对当地的餐饮业者来说，已经是期待已久的好消息。Saat ini sudah ada beberapa travel legend yang membawa tamu-tamu dari Cina ke sini. Puji Tuhan dan terima kasih kerjasamanya. Semoga nanti juga bakalan ada pihak-pihak travel legend yang lain juga yang ingin bekerja sama. Silakan. 打开国门之后的印尼，撑过了没有陆客上门的时期。但面对各国经济成长放缓，欧美旅客也不像以往这么热络。印尼的观光产业也受到影响。We believe with the、uh, slowdown in some of the key economies, we need to focus on the growing markets such as India, China, and also within ASEAN. Indonesia itself will grow north of 5%. This year, and we will have to focus on the backbone of this robust recovery by the movement of domestic tourists. 除了开发不同的旅游市场，更要留住来到当地的旅客。印尼观光部长强调，当地的旅游也因此正在进化，要让旅客能来到印尼 long stay. We will focus on the quality aspects. People who would stay longer. In destinations and better quality of spending into the local economies, it is evolving immensely. It's doing a fundamental shift from the three S of sun, sea, and sand to a new three S of serenity, spirituality, and sustainability. 包括宗教旅游以及生态旅行，都是印尼现在主打的观光重点。准备改变以往大批游客走马看花的方式，要带全球旅客来趟深度旅行。Located in some of the most beautiful spots in the country, and it is not suitable for mass tourism. So we have for a specific area an integrated tourism master plan that would. Basically, limit the number of tourists. The infrastructures will have to be sustainable. 印尼政府也推出全新的签证方案，欢迎外籍旅客常住或是投资，推出第二故乡新签证。只要外国旅客在印尼银行存进十三万美元，就能获得巴厘岛五年和十年的居留权。希望吸引各国的数位游牧民族，促进在地消费。但不少外籍人士因为去年实施禁止婚外性行为的法案，感到却步。Yeah, it's really worth me because um, uh, I'm kind of. Invest in Bali and go and invest in Bali more, and so uh, uh, it's really disturbing tourist uh, tourist flow here if they apply this law here in Bali. 观光部长就强调，已经跟印尼多个部会进行沟通，承诺会确保到访的印尼旅客不会受到影响。To ensure that hotels will not impose this law because this is a wrong interpretation of the law. Tourists, when they arrive in Indonesia, will be able to carry out their tourism activities safe, well protected, and not going to be disturbed. 但预估最快要到二零二五年才有望恢复到疫情前的旅游人潮，因此印尼观光产业改变策略，希望利用 low stay 增加消费额的方式，期待旅游产业尽快回温。TVBS 新闻综合报道。